At the Ocean Cleanup, our mission is to rid the world's oceans of plastic, and part of that is to prevent more plastic from, from reaching the oceans. With our research, we found that rivers are the, the arteries that carry the plastic from land to sea. And what we found is that just 1% of rivers is responsible for almost 80% of all the plastic going to the ocean. So if we stop the plastic there, we have a really good shot, I think, at rapidly stopping more plastic from going to the ocean. So with our interceptors, which we put into the mouth of the, the heaviest polluting rivers in the world, we hope to catch the plastic before it becomes ocean plastic. Now, 1% of rivers sounds easy. In a way, it's, it's good news, but on the other hand, it's still a thousand rivers. So that's a large number. And we want to do this in a matter of years. So, of course, on one hand, it's really important that we have solutions that are scalable, that we can just build many of in, in, in series. Of course, that's what's really ingrained in the philosophy of these interceptors. But at the same time, we've also come to learn that every river is different. As one of my colleagues always likes to say, if you've seen one river, you've seen one river. If you think about things like uh, tidal differences, uh, current speeds, the width of rivers, uh, the depth, uh, are there vessels or not? Uh, what kind of vessel traffic? Uh, do you have water hyacinths, so these green plants like you see in this river or not? So there's all these different variables and ultimately if we want to be effective at closing the tap, we need to always be able to have an effective solution for every one of these 1,000 rivers. We need to have the right solution for the right river. And that's why we have this portfolio of different kinds of interceptors where we can always choose the right solution for each of these different set of circumstances. So besides the interceptor original, we also have the interceptor barriers combined with an interceptor tender which is a mobile solution, so you can serve as different rivers. It's for any river, for any country where we need to deploy, we need to set up consortia of, of partners to, to make this a success. So you need the government relations, in terms of permitting, etc. You need an operator to, to run these machines. You need a waste management partner to make sure that the waste collected is properly disposed of. So you kind of have this sort of network of, uh, of partners uh, around it. So helping to, to you know, create a buzz in the country, help to secure you know, the right partners, I think that can tremendously accelerate that process yeah, to, to really deploy interceptors at a, at a high rate. When I look at our team, I see a group of people that is extremely dedicated and has this mindset of, okay, we might not have figured everything out, but we'll find out along the way. We'll, we'll learn by doing, because ultimately, these things may be difficult, but the ocean doesn't care whether we find it difficult. You know, this needs to be done, and eventually we'll find a way.